My name is Valerie Strong. I am a team athletic therapist with the Toronto Argonauts. Seeing everybody from the table, going from on the table, maybe hurt, and then seeing them just with a smile on their face after the treatment, seeing that we could help them, going from injured to just everyday life things, or a father that could can't pick up his child to be able to pick up his child. I wanted to be part of that, so that really what drew me into athletic therapy. Fell in love with football in my last year of athletic therapy. I worked with the York football team. I was able to do an internship with the Rough Riders in my last year of school and absolutely fell in love with the culture of football, especially CFL. And I was lucky enough to, right after graduation, the Toronto Argonauts were looking for a team therapist and I applied and I got the position. <laughs> As an Asian woman in, the, in this industry, I did have to navigate a few barriers where my interviews were male dominant, um, even white male dominant. Um, and just to break those barriers to me, I just stuck to my culture and what my pa parents instilled in me to do a bachelor's of psychology. And that was already left to the field for them, which they took it, you know, they took it all right. But then when I told them that I'm going to do something else, it kind of hit them hard a little bit. I tried to explain to them exactly what athletic therapy entailed, what types of jobs I can do, what environment I could work in. They were still kind of hesitant, but once I got into my program at school, they saw a change in my character. They saw how confident I got and how much I learned and how much I excelled. So that's when, you know, a parent is always going to be a parent. They'll be happy if their children are happy. To be the only Asian woman currently working for the Toronto Argonauts Association is an honor. I feel like I could be, you know, the first of many, hopefully the first of many. Just thinking about what my family has gone through in the past, like my mom being from Vietnam, coming here from the war, and then that I'm here, first Asian woman in a pro association is huge to me. I'm just hoping that this will open doors for not only more women, but more Asian women. My advice I would give, don't be scared. Don't be intimidated. Apply for any job that you want, even if you notice that it's male dominated. I was a little bit intimidated, to be honest, at first, because I knew that I fell in love with football, but in my head I said football could be very, very male dominated. But I stuck to it. I knew that's what I wanted to do. I kept my head up, worked really, really hard. And then that's what got me here. So I would say if you feel that that's what you need to do, that's what you want to do, just go for it.